A mother is fighting against the Roland Unified School District in a new lawsuit. She says her son told her that he was sexually abused by his teacher when he was in second grade. The former teacher is currently in prison, serving sentences for similar crimes against other students. I would assume where Annabelle Munoz has details, including the school district's response. A civil lawsuit is the latest legal action after a former elementary school teacher was convicted of child sex abuse. In 2019, Jose Cruz Martinez was sentenced to five years for inappropriately touching girls. This year, sentenced to 20 years, convicted of child sex abuse. The mother of one of the children in that case recalls when her child told her his second grade teacher sexually abused him at Roland Elementary School. Siento lo más horrible porque uno como padre se siente indefenso. It's the most horrible feeling, she said, because as a parent, you feel defenseless. Your world closes in on you. You feel powerless. You don't know who to turn to. And Mr. Martinez was 70, 55 years old at the time. Disgusting, vile behavior. For that reason, he was given 20 years in the criminal court. Now we seek justice in the civil case. The civil lawsuit is seeking damages from the Roland Unified School District, accusing it of negligence and failure to perform a mandatory duty, including the duty to report suspected incidents of child abuse. This mother says if they knew, they should have been the ones to stop it. The school district told Eyewitness News it takes all matters involving student safety very seriously and that inappropriate behaviors by anyone would not be tolerated, adding, in 2018, upon receipt of information regarding alleged misconduct, protocol was followed, law enforcement was immediately contacted, and the teacher was removed from the school. The district fully cooperated with law enforcement throughout the investigation and fact-gathering process. This matter has been addressed by law enforcement and the judicial system. In the lawsuit, there's also a claim that Martinez threatened to lower the child's grade if he reported the abuse to his parents. Attorneys say he eventually told his mother what happened after detectives began an investigation at the school. <laughs> Struggling to speak, his mother says she only asks her attorneys for justice. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel. And download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.